beautiful Chinatown. Uh, it's lunchtime, about 12, it's 12, about 12.48. And as you can see, there's a lot of foreigners here. This is the classic tourist place to be in Chinatown. Of course, every place is in Singapore is a tourist place. But uh, at this time, it is just colorful. Daytime. Actually, it's heritage listed, um, like any other building around this area. Um, later on, I'm going to go to the uh, Buddha Relic Tooth Temple, if, if that's named correctly, and uh, we'll go inside and have a look. Standing behind me is the, uh, the Buddha Tooth Relic uh, Temple and Museum. Uh, it is actually beautiful inside. And, uh, we'll, uh, we'll take a look. Uh, inside is a big Buddha statue. And up on top, in the top floor, there will be a uh, rooftop garden, which is actually very nice, very peaceful. And behind me over right there should be the famous Maxwell of Hawker Food Store that a lot of people have talked about and a lot of uh, YouTubers have actually uh, definitely been there before talking about the good food. Uh, we'll go check it out later. And now we'll head into the temple.
and third floor uh, will be the museum. Uh, there will be quite a lot of things that was donated by private collectors and it will be shown here in this temple. I'm currently at the rooftop garden of the uh, Buddha, Buddha Tooth Relic Temple. Uh, as you can see, uh, it is a beautiful garden. Now on the wall, you'll see many, many little Buddha statue and uh, with numbers and probably names on it. It's probably the, uh, the list of people that actually made donations uh, uh, to this temple. And uh, let's uh, go spin this wheel, this prayer wheel. Okay, beautiful. Beautiful orchids. And this is the uh, on the other side the rooftop garden. Unfortunately, I'm unable to access the third floor where the uh, where the museum uh, is located. Uh, it's currently under renovation uh, since the 5th of December. So that means I don't know when it's going to be open. So until uh, maybe my next trip back to Singapore, I'll, uh, I'll have a good look at it. Yeah. I'm on level two, and uh, there will be as we as I walk along the hallway along the corridor. Um, there will be uh, uh, little models of the past um, priests that have actually uh, been here around this temple. I'm not sure, but uh, we'll have a look. Uh, downstairs, uh, through the, uh, the curtains, you will be able to see the prayers that's actually happening. hour is over but as you can see there's still a lot of people still eating here uh, a lot of tourists and uh, well it's not jam-packed obviously but uh, yeah I'm gonna try and see what's interesting I have decided to go for uh, some sweet dessert instead of having a meal uh, because I had a late breakfast so I'm pretty full but I can't resist a good sweet dessert and this one is actually Ching Tung so it can, it can be served either cold or hot and basically I see dessert with uh, uh, long an, uh, lotus seeds and uh, some dried coconuts or dried passamon. Uh, it's actually, if it's done in white fungus as you can see here and if it's done right it's actually very delicious but the, so far that I've, one of the best I've eaten is actually uh, burdock, uh, burdock corner which is the best. So uh, usually the, the, the fake ones are actually just made from uh, um, palm, um, brown coconut sugar. So I'm going to try and see if 
this is the real thing, or at least close to the one that I had in the corner. Mm. It's okay, it's not the best. Mm. It's not the best. But for a dollar fifty, one dollar and fifty cents Singapore, you can't really complain. Really, can you? I'm currently at the People's Park Central. As you can see, the shopping around here is a little bit old fashioned as compared to the other modern Orchard Road shopping. It's actually very similar to the, uh, the old shopping malls that you find in probably in, uh, in Malaysia. It's the very, definitely very old style uh, compared to Orchard Road. And downstairs as usual, it's, the basement is usually the, um, the food court or either upstairs. But for this building, uh, downstairs definitely the, uh, the food court. Hey, you want bread and cheeses over there? Oh my goodness, this is a good, this is a good spread. Marshmallows. Where's the fondue? What's the fondue? Chocolate fondue. Hey, satay is here. Hello everyone, it's dinner time um, and I'm currently at the Concord Hotel. The, a, a very good spread, seafood spread, uh, oysters, yabbies, sashimi, uh, with a lot of food and desserts. So we're going to slowly enjoy it. There we go. Okay, what do we have here? I've got myself a uh, chicken satay, um, rock fried sea asparagus, uh, something that I've never tried before. I have a um, bit of, uh, what is it, um, jellyfish, um, oyster omelet, and uh, stir fried spinach with, uh, with abalone. Yum. Oh my goodness, lollies. You don't mind me taking a video of you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, want to escape? <laughs> Live prawns. Really? Yep. Oh, one that got away. Ooh, that looks good. Oh, sorry. We have in Pub Buffet is actually the abalone, stew abalone. This is going to be yummy. Mm. Mm. What is that? Mm. You're eating more? Mm. Mm. You want to try abalone? Slice it. Slice it. Is that the abalone from there? Or? No. No, this is special. Oh, you order it? I thought you said you were full. I eat slow. 
Okay.